Okay, first and foremost, I want to give all the honours, the praises, the glory belongs to my Lord and Saviour, whose name is Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shai, Bahasham, Wahavakar Kwadash. The name of the Heavenly Father is Yahweh. His son's name is Yahweh Shai, in who I reverence and honours to the apostles, right, across the globe and to the few. The very few brothers and sisters listening and also learning in the hopes of being saved within these last days. I don't know if I said that right. I'll say this. I want to give all honours and praises to Yahab Hashem, Yahab Hashem, Bahasham, Mahavakar, Kodash. Just to make sure I got it right. Honours to the apostles that are across the globe and to the few brothers and sisters listening and learning across the globe. All right? I want to get straight into this. It's going to be a quickie because I'm running out of battery. Flow with the spirit. Right, I'm going to give you what you need. Go to 2nd Ezra chapter 8. And he answered me saying, The most high have made this world for many. Right? For many. Right? But the world to come for a few. Read that again. This is 2nd Ezra chapter 8. And he answered me saying, The most high have made this world for many but the world to come for a few right so there's many in this world and the world was made for many but the world to come which is the kingdom to come which we're waiting for only a few even within our nation we're gonna have the few that make up for that first resurrection i want to be part of the first the first go around that's what I want to get right now I'm, I'm repenting now I want to make it on that first go around I don't want to come back in the kingdom in shame I want to make it on that first go around verse 2 I will tell thee a similar to Ezra's as when thou asketh the earth it shall say unto thee that it giveth much moulds whereof earth and vessels are made but little dust that gold cometh of even so the course of this world of this present world so you know how little dust cometh off that gold right and it could be a vessel a big vessel same way with the world right that's representing the few that will be saved there be many created but few shall be saved many created many created but few that shall be saved okay few that shall be saved right but few that shall be saved so we want to be that few and the scripture also says many are called few are chosen few are chosen so i answered right i and said swallow them down oh my soul understanding and devour wisdom Key thing. So I answered I and said, Swallow down all my soul, understanding and devour wisdom. But key thing, key thing, right? Many be created, but few that shall be saved. All we can do is hope and pray that we are of that few and remain faithful. Right? So what else can we go to? Because I did say I want to keep this lesson short. And if you are chosen, that's a blessing. This is John 15. And jump straight to verse 16. You have not chosen me, but I have chosen you. It wasn't up to us. It wasn't up to us. So if Yahweh chose you, that's a blessing. And ordained you, selected you. That you should go and bring forth fruit, and that your fruit should remain. And whatsoever you shall ask of the Father in my name, he may give it to you. These things will come on you that you love one another as well. So, you know when Christian says, I've accepted the Lord as my Lord. and You don't do nothing. It's Yahabashah that has to accept you. That has to call you. Okay. And go bring and bring fruit. So, the individual, just before I come up, I was having a little discourse. 
of an individual and he said have you bring forth any fruit have you got much subscribers i said i did have but over the years they get less and less and less because the lord is what doing a shift filtering the ones that are sincere and those that are not so sincere okay so we went to that one more scripture i think we shut off this is matthews okay matthews jump to matthew 7 and 13 enter into the straight gate straight position of difficulty narrow hard for wide is the gate right for wide is the gate and broad is the way but it's not the way to life that leadeth to destruction so wide is the gate and broad is the way that leadeth to destruction and it says and many there be there which go in there at so many are going into the what? that wide gate many right and there be many that go in there at many right so most of the world they're not on that same journey they can't really understand your journey they may even want to do what you're doing but they can't it's too hard for them it's too hard right so most of them they're in the way of destruction as bad as it may sound yeah most of the people that you see around you they're in the way of destruction and many there be that go in there at many many right there be that go in there at okay because straight is the gate and narrow is the way you have a told us straight is the gate position of difficulty bro you come into this truth you're gonna go through so much things that you wouldn't even think you would go through so much different things and narrow is the way position of difficulty narrow you have to squeeze in which leadeth unto life but the thing is it leads to life it leads to a kingdom and few there be that find it that's the few that's the few there be many this way this world was made for many but only a few shall be saved i hope this was edifying and until the next time, Shalom to the hopeful elect. Shalom.